we want to simplify the given expression. Notice how the given expression is in fraction form. Whenever we simplify an expression in fraction form, we treat the fraction as if there are grouping symbols or parentheses around the numerator and denominator, which means to simplify an expression in fraction form, we always simplify the numerator and denominator separately using the order of operations, and then in the last step, we simplify the fraction. So looking at the numerator, we begin by simplifying within the innermost parentheses. Notice inside these parentheses here, we have subtraction as well as an exponent. And we know we simplify exponents before we add or subtract. And because two squared equals two times two, which equals four, inside the parentheses, this simplifies to four minus three. And therefore the numerator simplifies to 437 minus five times the quantity of four minus three. And now looking at the denominator, we have division and multiplication. And division and multiplication have the same priority. Looking at step three, we multiply or divide from left to right. So working from left to right, 48 divided by four is equal to 12. The denominator simplifies to 12 times six. And now going back up to the numerator, we are still simplifying within the parentheses. Notice four minus three is equal to one. The numerator simplifies to 437 minus five times one. In the denominator, we have 12 times six, which equals 72. And now going back up to the numerator, we multiply before we subtract. Five times one is five. The numerator simplifies to 437 minus five. The denominator remains 72. And now in the numerator, 437 minus five equals 432. So the expression simplifies to 432 over 72. And now we need to simplify the fraction. And I believe 72 is a factor of 432. And therefore, one way to simplify this would be to divide 432 by 72. Let's go ahead and show this. I believe there are six 72s in 432. Let's go ahead and check this. Six times two is 12, perform an exchange. Six times seven is 42, plus one is 43. Notice how six times 72 is exactly 432. We have a remainder of zero, which means it simplifies nicely to six. But let's just say we don't recognize that 72 is a factor of 432. Let's simplify this like we simplify most fractions. Beginning with 432 over 72, we begin by simplifying out any common factors between the numerator and denominator. And notice how they're both even. Let's begin by dividing the numerator and denominator by two. 432 divided by two is equal to 216. 72 divided by two equals 36. Now let's say we recognize 216 and 36 share a common factor of six. We can continue simplifying by dividing the numerator and denominator by six. 216 divided by six equals 36. 36 divided by six is equal to six. And 36 and six also share a common factor of six. 36 divided by six equals six. Six divided by six equals one. And notice simplifying this way, of course we still get six. I hope you found this helpful.